And welcome back, YouTubers. This is SKS with Let's Play Oregon Trail 2. Uh, last time we left off, we were sitting here in Independence, and we were going through the party of myself, SKS, Moses, Caesar, Sal Sal, Hitler, and Helen Keller. I think we're ready to move out and get this adventure starting to see what legacy we will cut on the path to Oregon. I have a feeling with this group of people, we're going to go far, we're going to go big, and you're going to enjoy the trip as we take off. So let's start. They said that in the hints, if you listen to all the people who mumble on randomly, that the bigger wagon trains are the best. So we're going to go with train one, which has the least people. That's some good chippy music. It's 26 degrees. We're leaving out April 1st, 1848. We've traveled nowhere. So let's get on the road and see what trouble we can get into. Let's see how long it takes for something bad to happen. And we've reached Blue River. Let's see, depth three feet. It appears to be a fairly ordinary river. Let's see who's around. Well, this dude has one arm. He's got to be full of advice. The ice looks thick enough to just drive our wagons across. I'm sold. I was always told by my mom, trust a man with a gun, he tell you right. So, let's do it. Let's ford the river. Wow, I've got us across one river, and I've been elected captain. And let's see here. This guy back here's got dandruff scratching his head. This girl's confused. This guy wants to stab me. I'm pretty sure that's an issue. Either that, or they're not electing me captain. They're welcoming me into the back of this wagon and ready to ass rape me. And this girl's just happy that it's not her. So, yeah, we'll go ahead and take the position of ass rape, I mean captain, and move on. And in my first action of Campton, we have already swamped the wagon. So, oh no, we lost bacon. I don't know if we can continue on. Let's clean up the mess and go on. I told you it wouldn't take long. Westport, that's great. Let's wave and keep going. Oh, I forgot to change one thing. We're going to travel 10 hours per day and really get these people going. It's a muddy trail. Who cares? They will be fine. We don't need to, oh, we do need to go into Santa Fe. Let's go there really quick. Let's see, general store. Buddy, you got some bacon? Hmm. Hmm. There we go. Gotta have some bacon. There we go. I think that's good. Oops. We have our bacon. We're good to go. We don't need any of this other junk. Let's continue on our way. We've only traveled 38 miles, and we've already had issues. So, the path ahead is crystal clear. I don't think we'll have anything else to get in our way. Just listen to that travel music. Alright, Kansas River. The river may prove a little tricky. The toll is 660 to get across. A fairy, well that's what he's talking about. Let's see, see who's around. This guy refuses to look at me, but he's got to know something. My brother commenced to farm in out west two years ago. He said a better wheat crop can't be had. I hear a young child in a train just behind us was killed yesterday when a rifle fired accidentally as someone set it in the wagon. They buried that youngin' and covered the grave with stones so as the wolves couldn't reach it. Because the wolves would obviously damage it after the child's already been shot. Anyway, that guy did no help. Let's take the ferry. I do miss the little animations of suspense that was on the first game, where you didn't know if he was going to quite make it across the river or not. So you kind of have to use your imagination here. But St. Mary's Mission, maybe we should rest there and pray for a day. That sounds like a good one. Alright, morale is high. Everybody's ready to go. Everybody's feeling good still. Let's continue. Ah, another river. The death of us yet. Two and a half feet, extremely treacherous. The toll bridge is a buck. Let's ford the river. There we go. That's living on this that's living on the edge right there. I'm flabbergasted. Moses has randomly died of cholera. I don't know how that happened. It never once told us. Yes, he's dead. That's, that's, wow. 
hate to mention such a gruesome thing, but we have to make sure the grave is deep and covered with stones, or well hidden. Otherwise, the wolves or coyotes might dig it up. Yes, yes. Good, good. We know that wolves and coyotes dig up graves, and I think that's the least of Moses' problem. I guess just like in the Bible, he's not going to reach the promised land, but uh, we'll provide him a proper burial and move on. Hmm. And we're up to the Big Blue River. Four and a half feet. Rather difficult. Let's see who's around. Oh, this woman. I'm sure she knows how to get across. Pleased to see you. You folks missed a good time last night. Another oh, train I bet we did. close by, and we had a bit of a dance. Mm-hmm. I declare, my tired feet came to life hearing that fiddler. I danced a plenty. It feels nearly like back home to have neighbors and a gathering. I've made some dear friends whom I hope will continue to see in years to come. She got trained. That's exactly what that means. All right, so let's wait a day and see if the river conditions change. All right. Well, a little tricky. Let's float across. There we go. And here we can decide. Let's just go the wrong way. No, no, no. We're going to continue on the Oregon Trail Gamers and see what's ahead of us. If you played the original game, you know that anything can happen. And as soon as I say that, we have strangers ahead. Hmm. Let's approach them. They moved away. I guess they were scared. Must be illegal immigrants. I think it's time, after we get through the Narrows, to stop and hunt. It's time for Helen Keller to shoot. Oh, whoops, there she goes. Come on, Helen, you can do it. We'll move to a different area. Right there it is. Get them. They're right there. Come on. Shoot up. Come on, girl. Oh, my God, get the deer. Oh. Oh, you can't see, you poor thing. Here, let me take that. We'll kill something. There we go. All right. We got 10 pounds of game. She missed 11 times, and then we took over. All right. Let's continue on. Maybe next time we'll let Hitler do the hunting. He's usually pretty good at getting stuff. And moving right along. We have no water. Hitler's feeling okay. See, he's sad. He's not got to shoot anything. So let's visit the fort. A little patriotic music and see what we can buy at the general store. If I can find it. There we go. Supplies. With them saying they was out of water, it might be advised to get a couple of canteens if they have any of those. With it being a... Uh, ooh, ham. Never can go without ham. Usually they have water. Uh, brandy's a medicine. Yeah, we'll get some of that. Castro, my grandpa lives off that stuff. Oh, whiskey? Yeah. We'll take all you got, buddy. Um, hmm. Blankets, matches, tobacco. Usually they have canteens listed here, but I'm not seeing it. Or sometimes they have it listed as just water. Water, ah, there we go, water, water kegs. We'll get about five of those. Alright, we should be good to go. Let's see what Twiddle D has to say this here. This might be a good place to rest a while. Just what I said. We've done enough traveling for the time being. It won't hurt to stop for a day or two. Well, on my train, we don't stop. So, get back in the train and let's get moving. If I can find out how to get out of here. Alright, continuing on. Heavy fog, continue as usual. It's not like we're going to run into a building. Plum Creek. Let's rest here for a day so we can get snake bit. Alright, continuing on. Let's approach them again. I'm sure are glad to see you folks. We've been out here wandering for almost a week. Not sure of where we are. We got separated from our wagon train a ways back, and somehow got lost. Oh I'm my. about worried sick over my family, and they're surely worried sick about me. They surely be worried, my brother. We will find you a way home. Heck no. But I hope you don't mind if we follow along for a while. At least till we find our wagon train. Heck no. Oh, but whoops. I hope you don't. All right, you can follow right along, because right now... We're going to hunt. It's time for Hitler to hunt. 
He'll be sneaky. Just watch. No, oh, no. Rabbits aren't good for him. Let's scare something out. Huh. Maybe there's nothing out here to hunt? There's always something. There we go. Uh-oh. There we go. That's what we're talking about. See, I told you Adolf wouldn't leave us alone or let us down. Four times and 150 pounds of game. That's what I'm talking about. That's successful. All right, O'Fallon's Bluffs. Let's continue on. Uh-oh. Caesar has a bad code. We'll give him some more fluids. We'll have to keep an eye on him. Hitler has a bad code. That's what they get for going out hunting. We'll increase his fluid intake. Guess we'll have to rest the next place we get to. All right, the river looks difficult. But over 3,000 feet across, two and one half foot deep. We could ford it. But I think we do need to rest for a couple of days and let them get their health back. Alright. They're back up. Let's see. Headaches, runny nose, sneezing, sore throat. If they had some NyQuil, they could take care of that. <laughs> Alright. Check the conditions. One and a half foot. We're going to afford it. Oh my. Oh my. 33 pounds of bacon, a box of bullets, cheese, coffee beans, cornmeal. Oh my lord. I knew we shouldn't have been going so fast through this kind of terrain. With an epic stash like that, that man is probably right. So let's get the wagon upright and continue on. Alright, now we've reached a grueling set of hills. Since we lost half of our supplies in the river, it should be no problem. Let's check the The path up is not very steep. Let's just continue. Alright. Now we're at the windless hill as the music turns suddenly strange. Will they make it down the hill? Not very steep. Muddy. Let's slide on down. Alright, Ash Hollow. See, if I was traveling on this journey, I think I'd stop at one of these places and just set up shop and be happy there. But no, we've got to continue on. Let's make sure everybody's... They still get their fever. They've had it for like two weeks now. Alright, looks like we're coming up on Chimney Rock. I always remember this on the old game. A little bit better graphics. Caesar's feeling okay. Hitler's about back up the hill, so we'll continue on. Chimney Rock. I guess because it looks like a chimney. This looks like a good place to stop here. Uh, folks, we'll be back next time as we continue our journey toward the west expansion as we try to make our way to Oregon. So far, we've done okay. We did lose Moses, but he was an old man. History has shown that he would never make it to the Promised Land. So we'll see what happens with Caesar, Sal, Sal, Hitler, and Helen Keller, and myself, next time on Let's Play Oregon Trail 2. I will see you all next time. Have a great day.